So Moth Times Human is a new music composition that has been created to explore declining biodiversity through music particularly focusing on our nocturnal pollinators, moths. So I was put in contact with the wonderful scientists at the UK CEH. They told me that they'd created this relatively new system called the AMI system. It's an automated system that they use to gather data on moth activity. What I did was I took that data, which was a spreadsheet, and I brought it into some software called Max. I converted the data into MIDI, which allowed me to assign notes to the individual species of moths. So moths are important for three reasons. Um, the first one is because they're indicators of ecosystem health. Secondly, they're an important food source for lots of predators. We know that moths are really good pollinators of many wildflowers for example and also the crops that we eat on a daily basis. The system consists of a light which is specially designed to attract insects and then the insects are attracted to a white board. The insects land on the board and then we have a motion activated camera that takes pictures every time it detects motion of the moths moving around on the board and then we then process all those images using AI. Because industrial agriculture over the last few decades has got rid of a lot of biodiversity, what we're trying to do now is with regenerative agriculture is put biodiversity back so we're putting lots of habitats around the farm like wildflower strips, grass strips, tree planting etc. So it's important to have the instruments and the people, the ecologists to actually monitor that the habitats are actually doing useful work and getting species in to use them. What is really exciting is that the moths have managed to create these little motifs, these little melodies and the live musicians are two violins, a cello, a trombone, synthesizers and piano. The piece is about 12 minutes long, there's visuals with it as well and this is just the beginning. <laughs>